Welcome back to One East for turn 67. It's about to be the start of um, October. And yeah, my Southern Offensive has started a few months early. Interesting how the Germans react to this one now, seeing I'm threatening the flanks of several units, but only with a relatively thin but well defended area. As you can see there, I'm pushing forward quite a healthy amount. One hex from cutting off the Odessa guys. That's just very annoying. Get that? Isn't it? Of course, that, all, that one hex will have to be properly defended. They will go for it like anything. Ah, recon. Something I always forget to do. Pushing on these guys, trying to rescue that one, that guy there. Fine, that was just a little cheeky one anyway. I have been forced back from the destiny quite heavily there, or from the Romanian border quite heavily. That said, if these guys can just shift down one hex, they've bagged a good number of things. And the rail line is cut as well, so if they want to move out, they've got to move out the old fashioned way. Interdiction. Don't ask me why that guy's going all the way up there. Vehicle damaged. Nine. Again, I expect to be pushed back into the marshes. It's all about tying up German troops. German troops attacking here, or German troops that are not attacking somewhere else in my line. So, winter objectives. There's no easy major encirclement. The north pretty much down to keep it through to the top of the pier pit marshes is one giant trench warfare section now it's going to be very hard for me to break that I can't really take too many troops off I am thinking about stripping a fair few more off the second line around Sevastopol using this new army here to form yet another force where exactly I'm going to deploy them I'm not sure The prospects of driving for north of Minsk are pretty slim, that's where they got most of their tanks at the moment. Do I need more men down here? I will do if we're going to be pushing to Romania. Oh, that's a bit weak, I could hit them. Everything this front is not really giving me many chances for massive encirclements. Not that that's how the Russians play at this bit, but they like that. I think I could find my way through that. Romanians and Italians begin their dance. Find weak spots in the line plus. I don't think pulling. Right, and that's for support as well. There's a chance it will remain supply. Oh, that wasn't good. Okay. 
And I hope the mud turns soon. Whatever they got there is easy enough to push out of the way. Just means I won't be doing anything mobile here. Both three attempting target. They'll give me a few more kilometers of advance here. Possibility of encircling those two. Yeah, there's lots of mini mini pushes I can do. I've got those two new armies I can deploy in the south this turn, which hopefully will do them first, see what they can do. And then I can think about um, pulling more off this vast form line. Chances of cutting up here are pretty small, at least until the, Russian, the Germans start withering a bit. Hoping the 42-43 refits will start giving me a bit more offensive power. 43 now isn't it? It's very late in 42. Oh, I've got to be careful of here. Don't try and cut off that little advancing force. We are holding them there. They're against walls of tanks. Okay. Well, still not too bad loss wise. Anywhere we've got walls, they're just not shifting us now. They have to keep trying to push forward. Back attack held. Got to keep pushing, haven't they? That's an interesting place to attack. Yeah, you, you push up in there, you sent some troops in. These guys. Oh, that's interesting. Well, the thing is, if once I get through this line, there's not really much to stop me. And to stop them. Cat smacking his lips, I'm getting very suspicious. Okay, so the north, nothing happened. Oh, he's just been licking where we've put the flea treatment on him. It's fine. Doesn't taste very nice, does it? No, they don't seem to be falling for this one.
Probably more men I need up there. Hold that line, that'd be amazing. Yep. Do what I can to solidify some of these bits. Random old guy in there. Oh, which is which? Terrible thing to say. Well, that's definitely movement points, mate. Right, the guard's army. Isn't massive. I can probably use it somewhere else. I'll keep an eye on that for then. First things first, I need to die so I get to my tanks core. Oh, you want me to move any more at a time? I go on, he's just messing up my entire front. Never two directions should also help. I didn't want. You can shift him. Like, apparently. Use these guys must absolutely have to. Right. Those are both retreated this turn, so there's a chance of it. guys in the line. Yeah, I'm 
not expecting this one to work, but now second wave. Forty thousand to one, so four to one ratio. It's worst idea in the world. Your existence is just offensive to me. Alright. Second guard and army is not going to be able to do much more than move up this turn. Possible exception of their cavalry unit. Right, let's move this 8th army into some combat positions. Make sure if these guys are out. Oh, that was effective. More 8th army guys to fall into that hole as well. army unit to that. That's about it. That's nowhere near what I thought it was. Oh, we can fit three entire divisions into there. Oh, apparently I can't move my core any closer. Side now the entire army is engaged. They are fresh troops. Okay. Here we have another weak spot in their line. Push this guy here. Important bits, it routes them again. Start filling out these. Oh. Let's not put an air army on the front line, that would be silly. How good these guys are. Yep, they're going to hold. Just with numbers, that might be able to push it. Yep. Yeah, we're seeing, starting to see some more routes now, aren't we? That's fine. 
24. I think I can move them if I attack with all. Stop starting that guy there. Thank you. No, 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 I wanted everyone. No, I don't. Moving 50,000 men. There we go. Alright, that's now a cavalry core. Is I can move a few more guys up. Let's get that HQ unit off the front line. Place it with a new head. Okay, so might be up mute. Walls. Yep, we have a space to move. Not much else I can do there. Back to this in a second. The north is looking okay, because not moving to one of these spaces aren't giving me too much room. I'm gonna move troops. Where's that spare army? Hi there. 65th army is now gonna be made up here to help push down to the mountains and around the line that way. Basically I want to split these guys off from the rest of the army. So, Not even on a rail line, are you? Where's the sixty fifth then? And a bunch of troops. Been much you are back. I don't really care where they're coming from. But we're gonna get reformed in a minute anyway. Okay, you're too far. Too much movement from the rail ahead, that's the problem. Right, third guard's army should form up here. Gotta pull whole armies off just to make it look a bit neater on the front line. That allows me to put it to have been on the back. We're not really losing much in the way of strength on the front line. Oh geez, I don't know what to do with them. Army Corps, quite useful. As I pull troops off the line, I'm kind of replacing them with... Good God's Army's got enough guy hiding in here. I'm going to pull them off next turn. Right, anyone else up there? That should be enough for now anyway. 
So, congratulations, you're now 60 whatever army. If. I'm going to resist the urge to form the casual core mainly because I'm going to want them to span out a little bit. This is part of the line where I, I don't need, I need to be able to band rather than concentrate. Um, Crimea in front, apparently. Where is the cargo? Look that you are getting shifted. Congratulations. Now the mobile wing. Fifth division. Well, a few of these guys from the north down as well. Uh, Panzer Brigade, you know what I'm trying to say. Wait, if I can find another tank brigade, I might actually give them a tank. There we go. Normally I would do a bit more neat for the um, frontage, but you know this is a video LP. You don't want to see me messing around for three hours. It looks like guys throughout it. I'll see what his status is in the next turn. That gives me another little force, but I don't really want to strip too many men from here, otherwise the Germans will advance. I could pull some men from up here, but I'm kind of hoping I'll find some. I'm hanging around in the middle of nowhere at once. Now look, there's a bunch of rifle brigades down here. A new rifle division, whatever it's going to be called. One of them is a naval. All right. Actually, yeah, I've got a lot of troops down here I can free up. Get the check all the way down there. I mean, the Turks might come into the war. I kind of think they're not that stupid. Pretty much the first thing I'll ask is, oh, how's the war going out? I don't think And he'll just cry. Oh god, I've got so many men down here I've been way missed. army down here. And assign troops. Oh, the Germans are in so much trouble. What side? It was kind of force. That's forced me to build a nice little reserve without you know, expending it. But. Yeah, that another army group. Okay, so two new armies have just entered the fray. I 
could move the um could move the the caucus in right up. A little bit gaming. Right. That's a few hundred thousand men that's going to cause the Germans some problems in a few turns. Alright, so, see you then. Wah.